I love fencing. I love teaching kids. I try to make this the best in the world. From this come my passion. For 46 years, I never was late. I always try very hard and more. I will be every day like this, my last day in my life. And this is my philosophy. For me, most important part in your personality, when you can able to hard work. And when you'll be work hard, I will make fencer. You know how they say that everything you need to know you learn in kindergarten? Well, for me, I feel like it's everything that I need to know I learned through fencing. Maestro affected my life because he taught me that there's no limit to what I can accomplish if I keep setting those goals. If you work hard, you're totally committed to what you're doing. You can do anything. Immediately he takes on this role as kind of like a father figure. When you feel that someone cares about you, it just, you want to reciprocate that. and It makes you want to work that much harder and it makes you want to put that much more into the sport. Arkady may be the most passionate person I've ever met. I could tell from you know, the first time I met him that this was something more than just coaching people. Fencing in his students, that's his life. This is a man who has a great deal of emotion invested in his students, and his students are very closely bound to him. And I think because of that, they really feel like he's not just a coach, but he's part of their family. My mom asked my son what he liked about Arcadi, and he said, you know, he's the first coach that ever believed in me, which I thought was a great statement, except I actually coached him soccer. But it's true, because he was such a poor athlete, I really didn't push him or believe he could do anything. Whereas Arcadi believed in everybody who walked in the door and could take anybody who walked in the door and create a great fencer out of them. I mean, that's really, really unusual. You know, his motto has always been, I teach talent, I don't find it. And it's true, he really can teach anybody to fence, athletic, non-athletic, in shape, not in shape. I've seen kids of all shapes and sizes come through here and completely change their physique, completely change their coordination, everything. When you bring to me a bear, I will teach him fence too. Only you have to bring him to me. And he does this with surprising regularity. He goes beyond just the doorstep of the fencing club and into their outside life. And the parents that come here uh, that do really well with their kids are the ones that come and they understand what he's trying to build. Maestro loves fencing and is so passionate about it that he wants everyone to experience it. He understands what it can do for people, uh, for children especially, for their development. Uh, he believes in it 110%. With all the money we spent for lessons over the years, Arcadi actually paid us back a thousand folds with what he gave our kids. I think about my experiences from fencing. It has been an inspiration to me and it's been something that I take with me every single day and I apply those lessons that I've learned in my daily life. There's no greater joy for a parent than to watch their children grow and develop and become the kind of adults that makes a parent proud. They will make good colleges, they will travel around the world, they will be healthy, they will be good citizens.